Good day, team. Uh, Friday the 3rd, it's pretty much lunchtime now. Um, just heading off to another mission over the wire wrapper. Um, anyway, so I uh, had my truck away up at Trundles in New Plymouth for the last uh, last week. And I went up there two days ago and picked it up. Uh, all tuned up, 250 horse. 250 horse. Uh, like 650 new meters of torque. 650 new meters of torque. Both wheels on the left hand side up off the ground is like, ah, drops back down. All oh, right, back off on those corners. Um, yeah, so it's a little, little bit hairy now. Uh, brought my 300 Storm with me, and uh, so that's for all my short bush stuff out to about five, 600 meters. And then uh, bringing out my 7 wheel Storm as well, uh, which is the longer gun, not so easy to carry in the bush, blah, blah, blah. Uh, so uh, just in Martinborough at the moment, just done a bit of a stock up, get a few coldies. Uh, Give you an update, we might, might be able to pin something in the Sabo, just depends how heavy that rain becomes, but uh, fingers crossed it holds off. Because he's too fellow. Good. Uh, so boys, um, we got four deer. Hey, a couple of shit undies right now. <laughs> hey, birthday, Stefan. Cheers, first deer, and uh, is this your first um, time you've fallen down a hill in a truck? Yeah, first flip. Um, you probably can't see the angle I'm on right now, but um, Stacy's pretty much straight up and down there. And uh, there you go, I still can't see the top of the truck yet, so pan down. You can probably see now, there's the road, there's the angle. She's, uh, she's 45 degrees, eh? Cool. So, um, so yeah, we've, we've got a couple of fallow down, which is cool. Uh, I don't know if we're going to be getting them. We might be setting up camp here. But we're going we're gonna to cut this tree. Yeah, right down there, mate. Yeah, right down there. So, yeah, hopefully we can just pull her out and fucking carry on our merry way. Right, and I'll take good. over driving from now. <sighs> well, that was interesting. Just about forgot a gun. Ooh. Ooh, that's a big hole. Hey yeah, boys, we're out. Oh, look at that shit! <laughs> Rise and shine, boys. Nice and early. 4.30. Haven't been up this early for a fucking long time. <laughs> we'll, uh, have, a, have a coffee and a feed and we'll get on the road. After a solid night, eh? Four deer down. So we fucking, we got two of them in the woodshed. We've got uh, two we'll hopefully go pick up tomorrow. We'll go find some more now. The rain stopped last night, which was fucking good. But, um, yeah, hopefully a bit of sun today. Fingers crossed. A bit more luck, eh, boys? Woo! Get on it. About a hundred meters in, we've already bumped an animal in the bush. We had a crack right next to us, but the thick stuff, so we couldn't get in there at all. Boys, all right. That's right. Just spotted an animal. We uh, we've all just been up the top of Pig Ridge by just before half past six. Saw plenty of animals six, seven hundred meters away. Uh, a couple of others just keep moving through the bush. But we just had um, like drizzle the whole time, even though the forecast was like clear skies. And then after about an hour, that drizzle turned into pissing down rain and then wind. So we've just been sitting there in the freezing cold wet for like two or three hours trying to get eyes on deer where you'd see them and then everything would fog up and then they'd be gone. They'd pop up somewhere else, it would fog up and then they're gone. So uh, about 10.30 we went, ah, fuck it, we pulled the pin and we'll come back around as we dropped off the ridge and dropped back down towards facing the hut. Looking across the valley, the other side of the valley was in the sun beautiful so we're gonna uh get back on it's about half past 11 almost 12 now oh no it's about half past 11 and uh for the feed get the fire plant and try and dry out some gear and then for the arbor we'll head up the other side hopefully we get a bit of luck there but, uh, still two on the board from yesterday so that's good and so stefan with his first fellow on his birthday and uh Stacy shot the other one. 
as it walked up to Stefan's one line dead in, dead in the field. So yeah, it was pretty good. A little bit of excitement. Yeah, hope that we can uh, double that number this Arbo. Fingers crossed. So after the terrible rainy morning, um, we spotted a nice stag, uh, 300 odd metres. Um, so yeah, we decided to take him out. One for the bank. Well, everyone, uh, just dropped a stag from the last stag of the season. Uh, six pointer red. So um, we're just going to make our way down to him now. 300 meter shot. So, the boys, on the recovery there mission. You guys basically, want to turn hard right uh, if you can. It looks like that's where this um, gut starts. Got uh, Stefan on overwatch. He's guiding us in. There's a trail here, boys. You just might not see us once we uh, hit this, eh? Pig rooting everywhere. Oh wow, look at this forest. Far out. Actually, uh, Overwatch can see us. Sorry, there's another clear through here too, bro. So. Well, we found the fresh cast where he was shot and he's, the impact's knocked it off. We're following a blood trail down the hill. I hope more blood here. There he is, bro. Oh, shit, yeah. Oh, look at that. In the face here, out the throat, and through the fucking shoulder and lungs and shrapnel fucking everywhere. Wow. You know Thanks, buddy. Oh. That's one for us. But, I mean, uh, 168 grain to the face at 3,100 feet per second will definitely knock your antlers off. Cool, knife and fork set. Oh, hey! Three backpacks full of meat. Hands and knees stuff. Fucking hands and knees. Awesome, we're on the board. Yeah, so um, just after we got back to the top with that last uh, deer that we recovered, I uh, had a nice cold drink and uh, popped back around the ridge to the other face and spotted this sow and her piglets uh, 600 metres away. So uh, 600 metre, dialed up, let her rip, potato chip, and uh, this is the outcome. The shot. The miss. And man, the disappointment. I was, uh, I was gutted, but... It is what it is. Thank you everyone, back at the hut after our recovery. I'm gonna fire all of you some tucky gun. And then I'm fucking gonna be because I'm fucking cooked. Back is knackered. Did some hard hikes this, this trip. Well worth it. Um, three animals down and recovered. Good enough. I think there may have been a fourth, but we um we couldn't fucking get to it. So one of those things. But, um, yeah, we've seen plenty. We, uh, I took a shot of the pig up on the top tonight at 600 meters. I got the video of that, and uh, I literally was like from its fucking face at 600 meters. And uh, you can see the impact; it slowed down. Everything it looked fucking great. So I'll, I'll put that on because it was um, it was a big animal. Heaps of piglets with it, so it was a big fat sow. Probably I would have said easily 150 pound sow plus. So yeah, awesome. Good day. Successful weekend. Four deer down. Um, we had Landsar come in last night. There's a family lost somewhere up in the hills. Good weekend, boys. Oh, yeah. Um, back at the car park. Epic weekend. Um, I can just hear the Landsar guys coming up now. They, they got found at about 2 a.m. last night. They sounded like they went. Um, they were up on the Pig Ridge track and they dropped down 
as opposed to they lost the trail and instead of coming down to the hut they dropped off the side of Pig Ridge. Um, they were found on a face, probably tucked away from the wind because it was quite windy last night. So uh, glad that they're all okay. If you guys see this, you know, good, you know, I'm, I'm glad everyone's, you know, safe and alive and yada yada yada. Good outcome, good outcome. Apparently they were safe from that, they were just lost and couldn't get out. It's like all the kids are in the home, pretty young kids from the looks. So wicked, good stuff, they're all okay. Well, the search and rescue came out. Um, I was watching the kids while, uh, while the uh, police side by side went down and picked up the, the parents again. Uh, kids were pretty happy in high spirits playing tag, so they weren't too bad. The guys came up and um, yeah, they, they said they were pretty pretty happy and cosy and that, so they weren't in, in uh, problems at all. They just got lost and couldn't find the track and the kids couldn't walk in the dark, so they camped up on the top of Pig Ridge just under sleeping bags. Um, still got the boys up the hill trying to get pinpointed onto, uh, onto the deer again because it's pretty um, pretty hard bush to get through and, and find what they were, so ah, check this out. Caesar shot from up here. Blow his head to bits, her head, I should say. Come out here. Fuck. Just want to say a massive thank you to everyone who has watched, liked, and subscribed to this channel so far. Uh, it means a lot to me. I've grown up. Uh, in the film and VFX industry so adding this in with my hunting uh, is, is such a big passion and the more people that like and enjoy it the more I'll make.